My name is Deadpool, and we will be following my friend Nate around South Africa. We will be feeling now he was going to Cape Town. Now he was at the Castle of Good Hope. Really nice attraction, by the way. After the Castle of Good Hope, he went to Camps Bay. Now this is vacation. Now he is at the aerial cable to Table Mountain. Here is a first person picture of him in the cart riding up the Table Mountain. He is on Lion's Head Mountain as he watches Death Defying People. Here is his picture on top of the Lion's Head Mountain. Next stop is the Kalagadi State Park in Botswana, Africa. There's an elephant at the drinking hall and he is thirsty. Here is a lion looking cool in the desert. Here is where he stayed in a bungalow at the park. Here is Ricky Ticky Tabby facing Nag. Or at least it looks like Ricky Ticky Tabby. This is the Kalahari Desert. And it's by Kalagati State Park. This is a succulent. It's the plant in most deserts. This is a succulent also. It is very red and pretty. Succulents are like cactuses. This one's a cactus, but it looks just like this. Succulent. Cactuses have deep roots, so they can get water. Yeah, I wouldn't hug this. Kalagati. We went to Chobe National Park in Botswana. He took many, many pictures. This is a hippo. It can open its, it can open its mouth very, very wide. It has a very long neck because it needs to reach the top of the trees to grab the leaves. This is a zebra. Their stripes are believed to be camouflage devices that help them hide well in tall grass. This is an African wild dog. They live mostly in arid zones in the savannah. The wild boar. It gets attacked by many poachers. The gator is very efficient on catching its prey in the water because it swims very fast. It usually jumps up and bites him with its powerful jaws. I thought was Victoria Falls in Zimbabwe. It has really, really nice views. Picture of Victoria Falls. This is the really, really nice view I was talking about called Devil's Pole in Victoria Falls, where you can, like, look off of it. You gotta be crazy to do this, but I'd probably do it. River flows southwest of Zambezi. Things he did there was bungee jump off this rain train bridge, and the second thing he did was ride on this microlight to look at the river. He is headed to the Gabali Forest National Park. A monkey you see here is a primate. There are currently 264 species of monkeys known to man. Now here is Kenya. It is really, really beautiful. The city side is really beautiful. But, can, but it can also be scary because there is much poverty on the other side and people throw trash out their window. Uh-oh. Now he is at Magadashu, Somalia. Really bad place. Those of you who want to know why Somalia is bad, there are gunmen on the streets every day. There are people locked up like the Holocaust, and they depend on us for food. And there are buildings getting blown apart each and every day. An attraction he found was called the Bakara Market in downtown Somalia. This attraction he found was a La Badana Bush Bush National Park, probably the only beautiful place in Somalia. This place he found was called Laws Gil Rocks. These are what the paintings are on the rocks that you saw there. The last one he went to was called the Independence Monument. This is what it looks like when most tourists visited. Now this is what it looks like at night. I have to admit, it's pretty. It's pretty. He is headed to Timbuktu, Mali. Here is some of the priceless architecture found at Timbuktu. This is the famous Dijabuger Mosque. Up the trip. First, he went to Cape Town. Second, he went to Kalagade Transfrontier Park. 
Next, he went to Chobe National Park. Next was Victoria Falls. Then the Kibali Forest. And then Nairobi, Kenya. And then Magudashu, Somalia. And then the last stop was Timbuktu, Mali. I hope you enjoyed. This is the end. And remember, I'm Deadpool.